telling you, bro. You do one single thing that these certain select individuals do not like. One thing. Now. You become a villain in their story. The stories that they have. You become a villain. For example. Some woman you don't even know. From across the damn world. In Antarctica or some shit like that. She might want to FaceTime you. You say no. Because you don't even know who it is. And you're not out here to just be giving your time and attention and everything else away for free. You say no. And you're, the, you're now the villain in her story. Because you did not benefit her the way that she wanted you to. So, you say no once. You stand by who you are. A lot of people don't like that. They don't like boundaries. If people cannot use you the way they want, all of a sudden, they turn you into a villain. They don't want you to be who you are. They want you to be a version of yourself that best suits them. They don't care about what you want. They don't care about your boundary. Because if it does not suit them, they'll turn you into a bad guy or a bad woman or whatever it might be. And even though we're the villain in their stories, they're the clown in ours. Because that's what they are, is clowns. Clown world type shit. And that's the category they fall under. We want nothing to do with the clowns. Because we know what they're about. It's all about them. Demand, 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 demanding. We don't want to do it. We don't want you. We don't want to do what you want us to do. <laughs> and oh my God. That makes us bad. That makes us evil. We're the worst people on earth, scums of the earth. No, you're just a clown. That's the truth. The Jezebels are running rampant today, bro. Rampant. And I'm not even talking about anybody in specific, and I don't want nobody tripping up because a lot of women ask to FaceTime and stuff, don't think this is about you. It's just the truth. Like, these things happen all the time, regularly. I can barely say that because I got these damn Invisalign in. I got like a half a lisp with these Invisalign trays. But it's true. Same thing with maybe even your friends. Like, you don't fall under what they want you to do for them. Oh, you're not a good friend. What a, what a friend you are. They turn you in to be the bad person. Even though you've done a thousand things right, even though you've done them favors before, even though you spent money out of your pocket for them before. You don't fall in line one single time. Now you're the villain. And you know what? Sometimes you just gotta take the role of being the villain in their story. Like, who cares? Who cares what they think? Allow them to think that. Because we are going to allow ourselves to look at them as the clowns they actually are. They are the ones that are toxic. They are the ones that will be left with nothing. And we are the ones that will be left with the right things that are supposed to fall in line with our lives because we are genuine people. We are team players. And like I said, I don't even make this out to be some bashing video and bashing these people, but it's just the truth. And I stand by my word. This is what they do to us. They want to make us feel this way. You do even one good thing with your life that benefits you and it might not benefit them. They just cry about it. They complain about it. It's no problem when they do it. It's a problem when you do it. When they do it, you don't give a singular shit. Like that's good for them. 
when you do it, it's a whole problem. Why? Because they're not benefiting. They're wham, 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 because you are winning without them. You don't need them. You don't need your so-called friend's help. And all they do is cry and pout and moan about it. That's all they do. You have no problem with nobody else winning in their lives, but it seems like when you do it, it's a problem to everybody else. Every time you make a post on Instagram, people unfollow you. Your so-called friends don't support it. It's just ridiculousness. People acting like they're with you when they're really not. They envy you because you're doing something good. And that's what it is. And they, they, they look at us as bad people for doing what's best for us. But isn't that what everybody's supposed to do? Man or woman? I have no problems or issues with every single person doing what they need to do and what is best for them. As long as it's legal, moral, and ethical. But when you do it, it's a problem. They make it out to be a problem. You're going to see those people around and they're going to mean mug you. Because you're doing something good. You looking good. You sharp. You show up every single day. And when you see them, they just sob and moan to complain about it. Because you're doing things that's out of the norm. You're doing things that you should be doing. They don't like it. <laughs> they don't like it. But if they were to do it, you would. If they were to do it, you would support. Not them. Not their bomb asses. The real clowns of the world is them. <laughs> And what's funny is, in their two eyes, the way they see you is like, oh, he's a bad person, which is hilarious. Because it's y'all folks that are the bad ones. It's y'all folks that are the bad apples. It's y'all folks that need to pick up your nuts and let them sag a little bit. Because <laughs> they don't. It's just... You got none. So, it's what you do. You moan, complain about it. You won't let your nuts drop. Because you got none. They got no toughness. They, oh, complain about it. Complain about you doing something good. It's something different every week with them. Every week, it's something different. Last week, you dressed a certain way and they didn't like it because you looked better than them publicly. The next week, you did something else. You got a girl to look at you and the girl did not look at them. Now you're a bad person. Something different every damn week. They just can't accept that you was him. You was the Black and Panther. In the bushes. He's in the bushes. Yeah. And your nuts did not even drop yet. They're so emotional about the things that, 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 that you're doing good. So disturbed about it. Every last one of you clowns disturbed about it. You can't even make a post on your own damn page without people just 
rage unfollowing you. Oh my God, he's a bad person. How dare him make me look stupid. He makes me feel worthless. You can't take away my shine. Clowns. Suck it up, buttercup. Drop them. But no. They can't. Oh my god. Such a big deal. Oh my god. He's just doing it because of this. <coughs> He's just doing it because of that. He's not really the da 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 Listen to what the fuck you sound like, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to what you sound like. Guess that is you. And I'm just imitating the clown, which is you. We can't do nothing. We can't have, chosen ones can't have shit in this world. And yes, we are chosen. We are chosen to motivate, inspire, and uplift the people in a way most people in this world cannot do. Because we have it in us. We live that in life every single day. No days off, 365, even on Christmas Day, even on New Year's, we don't even touch alcohol because we're on our shit. We make time for family, and guess what? We make time to come back to do our shit. Because we live and breathe this life. Unlike the filthy animals that have something to say about every damn good thing we do. They paint us black. Which is why I'm wearing black in this video in the Black Panther. They paint us in a bad light. And sometimes, <laughs> you just gotta take the role as a villain, I guess. I guess. You go against me. We'll see. Cause it ain't gonna end good for you. But it's gonna end good for me. Most definitely. Drop those nuts, boy, cause they ain't. You're too caught up in your own fantasy bullshit. You can't respect what's right in front of your own two eyes. Blinded by lies is what you is. Make me sick. Every week it's something different. Pick yourself up, mate. Look what it's doing to your mother. You're tearing the family apart, mate. You're tearing this community apart. Look what it's doing. Are you happy with yourself? Are you happy with yourselves, mate? Pick yourself up, dust yourself off. But no. Well, he said to see something. Something different every week, which is. Every week. It's something different. God. This is the problem. This is a problem, bro. People don't wanna to come together. People don't wanna talk things out because they're just too busy living a life of emotion, how everything makes them feel. You gotta to be tougher than that sometimes. You little reptilians, you skinless lizards. You gotta be a little bit tougher than that sometimes. You wanna get shit done? You wanna get the dishes done? I work all week and I come home to this. Look at this mess. God. Look at this mess. Are you happy with yourself, mate? <sighs> ah, man. Every week. Every week. Something different with you, isn't it? <laughs> man. It's utterly concerning, like the viewpoints they have, the lenses they see through, the things they think. It's utterly concerning for their futures. 
but your future is surely on point because you do what's right all the time. Them, they're just cops. The real clowns making you look bad, making you look like a bad man. Look how bad he is. He's such a bad man. He only works his ass off, motivates and inspires people all across. And yeah, he's such a bad person, doing so much damage to society. Look what he's doing. Look what he's doing. We can't even dress a certain way publicly anymore, bro. We can't even do nothing no more. We can't have shit. Because the real chosen ones can't have shit in this world. Without all these losers all these real clowns chiming in on us saying this about us, saying that about us, saying all this stuff they'll never say it to you though cause you know why? cause they know they'll be put up they know they'll look real and stupid and they know you're just gonna give it to them and you ain't gonna stop you're going to let them have it, and they're just going to go to their rooms. Ten minutes in the corner, I don't want to see your two beady eyes. You look in that corner, and you think about what you done. You hear me? And guess what? I come home after working out and week. The dishes are still in the, in the sink. You can't even do that. You're tearing this family apart, mate. I am your father. But you're tearing the family apart. And look what it's doing to your mother. Something different every can wake. Which is all. What? God. They would actually love it. If we were phased. But you see, we're just clowning the clowns. We don't really care. We're just clowning y'all back, and y'all can't take it. Y'all can't take it! We just gotta expose the dirty, lying, filthy animal sometimes. It's what we do. It's what we do. Because we're so bad. We're just, you just mean, you grumpy, and you don't pay no bills. <laughs> we're just meanies. Maybe we're just on point. You ever think about that, Margaret? Maybe we're just on point. Maybe we just ain't playing no games. The no-nonsense no attitude. The dishes ain't gonna get done themselves. No, sir. They are not. It's gonna take two feet and a heartbeat. Get them done. Get the dishes done. You can't even do this. When I was your age, I was at home after work. I was cleaning. I was cooking. Taking care of the children. You can't even do the dishes, mate. What is this? What are you doing? Are you happy with yourself? Cause you're tearing the family apart. God. But like I said, sometimes you just gotta take the role as a villain and keep marching on in light because the truth is gonna be told and it's gonna be, it's gonna be spoken. And that's what's brilliant about time. There was times in my past where so many people around my same age group in the past put me out in this bad light. And all of a sudden, time goes on and 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 marches forward. You prove yourself as a professional. And guess what? They all fall to the pits of society. And you rise up. You are well respected. They are not the virgin bums on the couch in their parents' basement eating Cheetos. One by one they fall. One by one. 
all the lies, all the slander, so the such bad person you are. Guess what? It didn't end up being that. And whatever you're facing right now, with all these clowns, it'll be the same damn thing. Because it's one after the other after the other. Whenever some drop, another one's gonna come. And after that, another one bites the dust again. The truth comes out about them, and you rise. It's gonna happen every single damn time. Every time. You only gonna get better. They only gonna get worse. The villain. The villain, right, that you are. Such a bad person. Never done nothing good in your life. Never worked a day in your life. Never worked hard. No, you don't know what that is. You've never worked hard. No, definitely not. You definitely didn't earn the things that you've accomplished. No, definitely not. You're just a bum. They're gaslighting you harder than you ever can imagine, brother. You worked harder than them and probably lived less years. They could work hard for the rest of their lives and they would not even match up to probably what you've done thus far. Because they're all coming with the excuses. They're all coming with something different every week. It's something different. God. They're going to come with it all. They're going to come with it all. They're going to make you look bad. As is, is best as they can do it, they're going to make you look bad. When they're really the bad apples. They're really not dependable. They're really the loosey-gooseys of the world. That cannot be a team player. Not one of them. They never will be able to. They've never done it in their lives. They're just deception type people. They're gonna deceive you. They're gonna deceive the next. And that's all they're going to do. And that's why they get left with nothing. And you will be left with what you deserve. And it's all coming. It's all coming. They're gonna be the clowns. You're gonna be the hero. They paint you to be the villain, but you're not. They're the Joker, and you are Batman, and you are here to save the day, like the Black Panther in the bushes, taking out its prey. God willing, God bless. I will see y'all at the top. For real, for real.